All right, so we're gonna do this quick video. So just to recap, you got the top, sides, fingerprint scanner, power button, volume up and down, SIM card, and it does not have a rubber ring around a USB-C. White, 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 silver. All right, let's open it up. You got your, this is what I was most excited about was the um, little display thing showing up here. And um, let me show you again. All right, so we're going to do that. And it shows the little thing. It does not stay on. It disappears right after you, uh, it goes after a couple seconds and it just disappears and it doesn't show anything. So this does not have always on display. I looked around all there. Microsoft, man, get your stuff together. Put that always on display on deck ASAP. All right, so you open it up. Let me put my code in. All right, so you got the dual screens right like this. You can just set it. See how the, watch the wallpapers. You can move that and then the wallpaper all of a sudden goes on this side. And it's, uh, dang man, hold on a second. It's all shown on this side. Showing on this side, all right? So the wallpaper squeezes in, wide view, whatever. And also I have it on auto rotate, set it up like that. Have you noticed that? When you open it up, the icons smush together all together like that. This is using the Microsoft launcher. So, you know, you got the little dots. How many notifications is this? That's pretty cool. Um, you got your widgets. What you can do is you can hold it. And then you got two pages where you could just go boom, 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 boom. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and delete. Remove that page, actually. And then when you do the change the wallpaper, it has it where you could save it on one side or the other or change different size if you want to. So anyways, you got that. Then you got like the Microsoft Google feed homepage like that on this side. You got your widgets. You got your widgets. I'll show you a quick view of the widgets. There you go. Rolling through the widgets. It's the quick, just the regular widgets. Okay. Regular, 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 regular right? widgets. All right. So we're going to go back. Take that out right there. Okay, so you got your app drawer this side, app drawer this side. So let's say you want to do the, uh, oh, let's go through the settings real quick. All right, so you got the settings. All right, so <coughs> first thing is network. You got your regular, regular stuff. Bluetooth connection. Apps and notifications. Sound volume. This does not have, this has like mono speakers. If you're looking on this side, it comes out of here. If you're looking on that side, it comes out of here. Um, it does not sound very good. Here's the other options. Um, we could just hear a regular ringtone real quick. Here, let's go. That's what it sounds like on the ringtone, the polyphonics. All right, we're going to set that up. Display. This does not have the always on display, which I was really disappointed in. So here is all the stuff on there. It does have an adaptive brightness, so that's cool. So screen timeout and everything. And you got the wallpapers. I'm gonna security, fingerprint unlock, and all that. The privacy selection for the privacy options. Um, accessibility options. There you go. All the things in there. Take that off. And then you got digital well-being. Information about how you use your phone. The account. I'm not going to go through those because that's going to show everything else. Alright, so you got your system information. Your battery information. And then your storage, whatever you want to do, decide to do smart storage, whatever file system. I got the 256 gig model. So you can see that system takes about 22 gigs. And information about Duo, tips and tricks about Duos, this and that. All right. So anyways, that's that. Um, so let's see. What do I want to do? So you can... Go sideways like this and it'll go this way hold it like that that's cool um, let me for example let me show you I want to go to uh, like a Google thing and I could go just like that and then move it on to the left and it'll show on the left hold it up put it and you can see that little thing expand like that 
and then you can make it like a big screen Google experience like that or you could like roll it down like this and it automatically it's sliding up reminds me of the um that one ZTE it was a ZTE I don't remember what it was like one of them phones like back in the day but anyways that's how it goes so let's see the keyboard I, I downloaded the Google keyboard because I like this better um I don't know though look at this the Y is kind of like missing whatever this button is too B is like right in the middle it is like touchable but it's like it's kind of weird should be like a split type. They need to fix that. I don't know why. What's going on with that thing? Uh, you might as well use the Microsoft keyboard. That might be a little bit better. So this is what I like right here. Like you can actually like type. Actually, this isn't even. See, look, the Microsoft Switch keyboard. It shows up kind of perfect like this. It'll show up everything like that. But when you use like that Google keyboard, like it's kind of all centered. I don't know what's going on with this damn thing. They need to update this for the surface, man. Look at that thing. It's like all sticking out on the bottom or something like that. It's kind of silly. That was actually kind of silly on there. But anyways, I mean, it's pretty smooth. 60 hertz. You know, it's not, you're not going to get like, you know, you're not going to get what you're going to get on like one of them Samsungs. But I mean, it's pretty, it's a, it's a pretty new device. It's pretty cool. Um... It's got different kind of angles. This one thing I don't like about this thing is, let me show you. You see how this thing's on the side? I need it to be down here. When I'm in this view, I need it to be down here. What, what am I going to do? Like, go like that on the side? That's that's kind of silly. <clears throat> Excuse me. Let's take a look at YouTube. YouTube. YouTube right here real quick. Real quick. YouTube. Where is it at? YouTube take a look at youtube all right let's see um let's look, look at one of my videos so i made this video earlier the unboxing right, so we're gonna do the quick unboxing i'm gonna make a two-part segment see what, this what so this is the gotta put that 1080p on there okay so you could do that and then you could also browse like the web on here do whatever on the uh, each side and you go like that you're gonna do the browsing the web and watching a movie video or whatever on there so you can actually go up on this thing speed it out like that and it comes into the tablet view thing like that tablet view see how it goes like that with the tablet view you can look at the next thing and then you can look at the comments down here oh wait no nah, I messed up where's the comments at Oh, the comments are right here. They, I forgot they changed it. But I didn't have any comments, so that's why I didn't know comments show up. But you can do comments right there. All right, and then you could also go like this. And then you could, you know, scroll it up, look it around like that. Sit it like that and watch your videos, whatever you're trying to do like that. Hold it up like that. Put it just like that. And then you can put it on one side if you're tired of that. And then... Do like a multitasking thing and you could just like you know go straight to that so that's pretty neat um i don't know what else there is to talk about on this thing i mean you got your keyboard i showed you that just taking it off um overall it's pretty neat you got your oh uh, you you got your camera going on got your camera right here and then you can turn it over double tap that go like that you can't do that feature you with that zte version where you go like this and then the other dudes like watching a movie on this side it's not gonna it's not gonna work like that it's just gonna be like one person watching a movie and not the other like the only way you're gonna get that going is like if you go like that but then it's just like goes into one once you start folding it halfway when you get about this close yeah, that's it. You got to be about like that. And it's going to show up about that about that much. And then you can kind of like show the other person one thing and then do one thing on the other side. So it's not like multi, multi, multitasking. But anyways, that's yeah, that's about it for the whole thing. Um, See the camera. You could do the camera on each side. You could do it on that side this side or you can make it 
a big camera deal where you just take hold on let me take off this picture you can take just one one camera on that and that's about it i just got off of work so i'm freaking tired i'm just trying to get this thing done asap um but anyways that's the whole review on the microsoft duo and i'm gonna be doing a giveaway on one of these things so you know keep your um keep watching and then um what's it called uh I got the Galaxy Fold Z coming up. Galaxy Fold Z 2 coming up soon. So, you know, keep your eye, eyes out uh, on YouTube for that. And if you have any questions or comments or any other thing that you want to mention, um, you know, let me know in the comments below and I'll try my best to answer whatever questions that you have. You know, now that I think about it, this could be like a cool like little clock stand thing like that. I don't think it's going to stay on forever, but it'd be pretty dope. Have you noticed, though, on this thing, if you kind of... Hold on. Let me see if I could go back. Man, close this tab. It's, it's kind of buggy. It just came out, so it's kind of buggy. But anyways, if you notice, you can't see the little... Uh, what's it called? The, um, the, the, the weather there. Only when you open it up, you can see the full weather. Or actually, yeah, see, you can't see the weather when it's on landscape view. I don't know what's going on with that. They need to fix that. There's a lot of bugs in here that they need to fix, actually. So hopefully, you know, they're going to get on that. See, look at that. It's not even... What happened to the app thingy or something? There you go. This is like another bug. But anyways, that's the end of the review on that. And if I miss something, if you want to know something else, got questions, let me know. And then I will definitely answer them. Or make a new video if I got a lot of questions later.